Here we go. Hey, it's Tony here at Smart Toyota out in the detail shop today. Excuse the noise. There are men at work, ladies at work back here. Hey, in this video, I'm just going to dive underneath this 2025 Toyota Camry SE Edition all-wheel drive. I want to show you the uh, undercarriage on this. This one just came in. It's uh, spotless, perfectly clean, so a good opportunity to look underneath. So let's do that. First of all, quickly underneath not a lot to look at they cover the bottom of the vehicle with this uh protective plastic here it protects the undercarriage from stone chips dents and dings those types of things also supposed to help with the aerodynamics underneath here and so not a lot to see but i'll show you what i can so let's take a look over here at the suspension in the front wheel housing now the four wheel disc brakes are here on the back side on the SE edition, anti-lock brakes, traction control, all standard. Here's a quick look at the wheels from down below. And those are gonna be a 235, 45, 18 inch wheel and tire, gloss black painted on the SE edition is standard. This one does have the uh, factory mud guards uh, upgrade on here as well for all four wheels. They have these little uh, pieces of plastic right here, actually they're rubber and uh, these are called wheel splats designed to protect the front of the car from uh, debris as well so they're really providing a lot of extra protection under here don't be fooled by the plastic there is actually metal underneath in fact here's your front subframe right here but it's all about aerodynamics and protecting the undercarriage of the vehicle in fact here's a slot here that's allowing air to flow up through and past the engine to help with the cooling as well down through the exhaust system. So we'll slide back a little bit further. Here's our exhaust. This is a 2.5 liter four cylinder uh, hybrid system. And you only have one muffler coming out the back. We look way up in there. There's the, uh, the prized catalytic converter up there. And then the exhaust coming all the way out and heading to the back of the car. Now, if you look at this aluminum right here, those are heat shields. They run all the way the length of the exhaust here. And the idea is to keep the heat from the engine and the exhaust from transferring into the uh, driver's compartment or passenger compartment. There's a reinforcement being here, again, to help with the uh, stiffness and rigidity. The SE Edition is a sportier ride, so it does have a stiffer suspension. Now, as we come toward the back here, one of the things you can't see anymore because they've added all this plastic but maybe you notice alongside the exhaust there there is no drive shaft going to the rear wheels so this is an all-wheel drive version of the camry and as such no drive shaft the rear wheels are actually powered by an electric motor here in the back and you see this uh, orange cable here that's actually your power cable to power the uh, rear wheel drive, the all wheel drive system. And then on your back suspension, you can see we've got a coil spring, independent rear suspension. Each side can react to the road on its own on both sides here. So it does provide it with a lot more rigidity, firmness, and the sporty ride you might be looking for out of your SE edition. And then as we come back here, notice we've got the uh, tire well you pop the trunk and flip open the lid you can actually see how that dips down into the uh into the trunk you kind of see the spare tire area there as well now on the uh se edition as i mentioned it's a four cylinder single exhaust but they do have dual exhaust tips coming out the back but don't be fooled by that either because this is the only functional one right here the other one is a full exhaust tip to give it a sporty look and feel. So it is not a dual exhaust tip tailpipe, nor is it a dual exhaust system. Just, that, just there to give it the look and feel of a sportier car. This is a Camry SE all wheel drive with the black badge package up top there. You can see that. Just a really, really nice quality car. This particular one has a lot of extras on it uh, over and above the all wheel drive and the SE package. I believe the list price on this one comes in at a little over thirty-seven thousand, uh, and that is a special color on there, uh, supersonic red, four twenty-five extra for that color. Oh, by the way, right here there are some air vents 
These are not faux air vents. These actually go all the way through the wheel wall there, the front fender, and then they allow air to pass through to the wheel. So not a faux vent like they used to have. The idea is it allows air to flow over the wheel, over the disc brakes when you're cornering to help keep those disc brakes cool. And then one of the things that's nice about the SE and the XSE edition, they added these extra flanges here, again, for styling and aerodynamics. So you'll see that only on the SE and the XSE edition. And then it's an all new front bumper cover, front fascia on here as well. Now I will be dropping this down. I'll take it outside and I'll do a walk around video to show you the upper part of the car. But this is a really good opportunity to see what a 2025 Camry hybrid looks down under. Hey, if you like this video, go ahead and hit that thumbs up and then make sure you like and subscribe to the channel because I will be doing an exterior, an interior, and possibly even in a test drive in this exact car. This is Tony here at Smart Toyota. Thanks for watching.